Hello, family of God. This is Vicki and Chuck. Welcome to TLC. This is the day the Lord has made. We are rejoicing and being glad in it. It's a beautiful day here in the Midwest. We're so glad you guys joined us. We hope that you're having an amazing day or you've had an amazing day with Father and you're just full of praise and joy and thanksgiving. Whether it's because things have been wonderful or because you've been through huge trials today. Praise God, you guys. He's good and faithful in everything. I want to read today out of the book of Luke. I'm in uh, the King James Version today. I'm in chapter 11. And it came to pass that as he was praying in a certain place, when he ceased, one of his disciples said unto him, Lord, teach us to pray, as John also taught his disciples. And he said unto them, When you pray, say, Our Father which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. As in heaven, so in earth. Give us day by day our daily bread, and forgive us our sins, for we also forgive everyone that is indebted to us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. And he said unto them, Which of you shall have a friend, and shall go unto him at midnight, and say unto him, Friend, lend me three loaves of bread. For a friend of mine in his journey is come to me, and I have nothing to set before him. And he from within shall answer and say, Trouble me not, the door is now shut, and my children are in bed with me. I cannot rise and give thee. I say unto you, though he will not rise and give him because he is his friend, yet because of his importunity he will rise and give him as many as he needeth. And I say unto you, Ask, and it shall be given you. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you, for every one that asketh receiveth, and he that seeketh findeth, and to him that knocketh it shall be opened. Father, we thank you. You are a good, good Father. You see our needs and you provide for our needs. And you are so gracious and giving and loving and kind. Thank you for being the Lord God Almighty. Thank you for the gift of this day. You gave us another day. You gave us breath for our lungs and beating hearts and you made a way for us to be able to come to you through the gift and the sacrifice of your son. The veil in the temple was torn in two. Thank you, Lord God, that you want fellowship with us and that we are blessed to be able to have fellowship with you if we will just choose it. So today, God, I pray for all of my brothers and sisters in Christ, where there is guilt or shame, where there is condemnation, Father, I pray for a setting free, a release from that, a repentance and humility in all of us that is pleasing in your sight. I pray for courage for those who just don't know how to turn or what to do. I pray for confidence and trust in you to grow more and more day by day, line upon line, precept upon precept, as we draw near to you in humility and you in turn draw near to us. We love you, Father. 
Thank you so much for your goodness. We pray for the ones who are lost. You're not willing for anybody to be lost. We pray, Lord God, truly for your kingdom to come and your will to be done on this earth the way it's done in heaven where you reign. And Father, we invite you, please be seated on the throne of our hearts. Show, if, show us if there are any idols sitting there already. And I pray for the humility for all of us to tear those things down and get rid of them. To put things in their right perspective, there is only one creator. There is only one who is worthy of our praise, and that is you. There is only one that should be seated on the throne of everything. And that is the Lord God Almighty. We bless your name, Father. I pray for encouragement to be poured into your people today, for the hands that are hanging down to be lifted up in praise, and the knees that are feeble to be strengthened with resolve to stand and walk in holiness with the Almighty God. We bless your name, Father. And we thank you for these things in the name of our Savior, Yeshua, HaMashiach, Jesus the Christ. Amen. We love you all very, very much. Thank you so much for all of your support, your love, and your prayers. May the Lord God Almighty continue to bless him, bless you all according to his will and his purposes for your life. That's our prayer in Yeshua's name from Chuck and from me.